Travel is changing more rapidly than ever before. It's never been more important for you to stay ahead of the trends. So to help you grasp the latest innovations and how they change your business, we've assembled representatives from some of the biggest names in technology to teach you a little about how these trends are affecting the industry. Moving to the cloud can actually reduce costs is, is the message I'm getting across. With social media, what you should be looking for is uh, what you want to get out of it. What is your ultimate objective? Who do you want to talk to? It really has, has moved from, from being larger updates less frequently to being more updates with less content in them. Gone are the days where a customer would go to a place to be online. Right? You know, I no longer go online, I am online. Well, I'd actually argue that it's imperative to keep updating. It's actually not a really good idea to hold off because organizations have a process memory. And the fewer times you execute a process, uh, the less likely you're going to want to do it or you're going to do it properly. So I'd argue you update more frequently with less items. Predictive analysis helps solve the what if questions. For a company travel administrator, being able to ask your travel management company, what if I moved my policy to three days earlier? Or what if I moved it to three days later? And finding out what that meant for savings or for additional cost to the business. The travel industry is a great example of seasonality and perhaps a spike in usage based on special offers and things like that. So cloud computing can actually uh, allow customers to own the base, as in own the base load, and rent what we call the spikes. And that's where the cloud can come into its own by catering for those spikes in demand and it's a pay-as-you-use scenario. Cloud to me, when I think of cloud, is the ability to turn on and turn off uh, compute power and infrastructure on an as-needed basis. Just take a look at the partners you can, you, you can work with and uh, the ability for you to future-proof your business. And you know, their prediction for 2013 was that we'd see um, 340 million desktops and laptop devices sold but at the same time 2.1 billion smartphones and tablets. If I'm a potential customer for a travel retailer and I decide that I want to go and research travel options to, to a destination, um, I want to do that now and I'll do that now with whatever device is handy now. I think there's an um, opportunity to mobilise your sales team and, and turn them from sales professionals to sales consultants. You know, maybe you walk into a storefront and sit down at a round table with your travel consultant instead of looking at them across the county and now sitting around the table, they're taking you through a purpose-built application for the tablet that allows you to have a, you know, a more um, consultative engagement with the customer. You know, think of the mobile travel agent who'll come to, come to you after the kids are in bed or come to you at lunchtime and will um, work with you around a tablet designed to, to tailor your travel experience. Who do you want to talk to rather than what platform should I be on first? Uh, working that out, uh, that then will give you understanding about where you should be. For instance, LinkedIn. Uh, if it's uh, high net worth individuals, more first class business travel, then certainly that's the platform you want to be on. Really needs to start with, not should I be doing everything or which one should I do, it's what do I want to get out of it? What is my ultimate objective? What is my strategy for uh, my business? Building that relationship over time when they're actually not thinking about holidays is really, really important. As we've just seen, the travel industry is one of the most dynamic industries there is. So for all of us, it's very important to stay ahead of the wave when it comes to new technology. We hope this thought exchange video has provided you with some valuable insight into the changes the travel industry is facing today and a snapshot of what to expect in the future. One can only wonder, what next? <laughs>